Hey, what's up, guys? Exo Azam is here again, and I'm coming at you today with even more Galaxy Eyes Photon Dragon. This card, I mean, this deck is freaking fantastic. Out of all the 20 matches that I played, I only lost twice. This deck is freaking awesome, and it took me about like five minutes to build. So I'm just showing another dual video of this deck against Hieratics which was pretty awesome. My opponent didn't do anything for now. He wanted like to make his big play on the second turn. <laughs> I was surprised that he had the Swiss Scarecrow. Anyway, now he just goes and spamming and special summoning and special summoning and special summoning and and more special summoning and, and special summoning and just go in and go in and pushing as hard as he can. He just goes and goes and goes. So he brought like 10 monsters over here. At this point, he didn't realize that my Galaxy Knight is stronger than his monster. So he accidentally attacked my Galaxy Knight and lost one of his monsters. I was so lucky that he did that. But yeah. And at this point... Wait, one sec. Oh yeah. At, at this point, um... I nearly like lost hope at winning. I just said let's just do anything that I can. I activated Galaxy Zero just I just at this point I had nothing to do. I was hundred percent certain that I'm gonna lose. So he attacked, I lost some damage over there. So at this point at this point I stopped for a second and then said Heart of the cards, guide me, and I did all of that in, like in my mind for a second. And I, I could have sworn that I actually heard the music. <laughs> so guys, let's give us some music. I have drawn Galaxy Eyes Photon Dragon. That's the perfect card. That was the exact card that I needed to win the game. I was actually thinking about it. I said, I was like saying, I need Galaxy Eyes Photon Dragon. I need Galaxy Eyes Photon Dragon. And then I got it. I couldn't believe myself. So I just went for my huge play. Then, bam. 4,000 attack monster. Like, even when I lost hope. It was freaking awesome. So my opponent just goes for defense now. He's just starting to defend himself. I, I am so happy this guy turns to defense mode every time he attacks. Or I was gonna lose at this point if my guy or my photon crusher. I was so happy he turned to defense mode. So he attacks and he has like no hope at winning. And here I just attack and you know. And luckily, I got another Galaxy Knight over here, which allowed me to bring out another one. I went for Sun God Dragon, I was really afraid of his face down, and it turned out to be an MST. Hmm. Looks like you can't trick. At this point, he tries to, like, attack me, like, to lose the game, but that wasn't enough. So he just gives up over here. Here, I was playing against a Synchron deck. Um... I'm not sure why he didn't like go for Quasar like I know he could have went for Quasar but uh, I think he did some misplays he actually wrote for me that he did some misplays yeah and the funny thing is he set down Royal Decree and I don't run any traps in this deck only spells so I just go for my usual play just attacking and going and attacking by the way guys, did you know, if 
if like I attack with the Galaxy Ice Photon Dragon and my opponent activates Magic Cylinder, you can use Galaxy Ice Photon Dragon's effect to banish him and you won't take any damage. This card is even like resistance against against Magic Cylinder. So you just just synchros over here for what's this guy called? Junk Archer. But that still wasn't enough to beat me. And uh, just pop the face down. I didn't like it. Galaxy Knights is such an awesome card. I really, I'm really glad I have Galaxy Knights in my deck. So you guys, eh? And go for the OTK. And today, this morning, I was facing a Earthbound Immortal deck, which, which I thought was pretty awesome, because. I don't see Earthbound Immortal see in a lot of play recently, or like any time. So I went for my dark, Lightning Darkness Dragon because I said, why not just negate everything he has? That would be cool. I would just, let's just attack and all. So yeah, and unfortunately I cannot destroy Marshmallow. So I attack his monster and that was like the last time that my light and darkness dragon can negate an effect. And he had nightmare arch fiends. I don't know why would you have this card in a earthbound immortal deck. So here he, I go for my usual in usual play in my galaxy deck. Just keeps special summoning, keeps special summoning and all. Here I added another Galaxy Ice Photon Dragon. I needed that. At this point, when he attacked me directly, I said, okay, it's all right. I'm gonna use this card's effect so I can bring out my Galaxy Eyes and I'm gonna attack him and destroy it. But I made a huge mistake that I forgot that I cannot really attack Earthbound Immortals, which like really hurt me. Like I had only a thousand life points left. So thankfully I got another Galax Galactic Charity. At this point I set my Galaxy Ice Photon Dragon face down. That is because when uh, a Slapisku is destroyed, it like destroys every monster on the field, every face up monster, and I take 800 points of damage. So I didn't, wanna, I didn't want that to happen or I would have lost. So thankfully. I had my MST to destroy the field spell. One of Earthbound Immortals' biggest weakness is that they rely on a field spell to stay alive. And here I went for one of my favorite cards, number 107, Galaxy Eyes, Tachyon Dragon, which I really, really do love this card. It's an amazing card, especially the artwork. It's amazing. Maybe I'm going to make a video about my top 10 favorite artwork cards. And my, the heart of the card guided me again and, uh, and uh, got me my photon crusher. And here, just um, testing my Galaxy Eyes deck against a Dead Rulers deck. For those of you who don't know, Dead Rulers is basically um, a deck that relies on Dragon Rulers. But I call it Dead Rulers because it, because it's not really that effective. Some people are still so desperate trying like to make this deck still work. But I don't think the Dragon Rulers will be coming back soon. So yeah, here I just attack and all. I do admit, his deck was a bit like quite creative and I did love it. Especially when he went for that Star Eater. But I, luckily, I used my Photon Dragon effect to save him. Yeah, and I just go and attack and all. Hey guys, you have to admit that um, Star Eater is a pretty awesome card. Look at this guy's artwork. So awesome. He also, um, <laughs> uh, Jeweled Red Dragon Archfiend, he has an awesome artwork too. Like every card I know that like has an awesome artwork like this guy. 
number 62 has an awesome artwork. And then let's just attack. Unfortunately, now that my number 62 doesn't have any, ex that doesn't have like Galaxy Ice Potion Dragon as an XYZ material, all of its damage is like half now. Mm, that was kind of bad for me. And uh, I got my Galaxy Tyranno. This card actually saved me once, and I'm really glad <laughs> that I put this card in my deck. Really helped me a lot. And here. And I didn't realize that he had only 2000 attack. I thought he has 2800. God, I'm suck. I suck at math. No, guys, this is not over yet. We still have one more duel video. Um, here, um, I was playing against a Venomanaga deck, which I thought was pretty awesome. He had the Rise of the Snake Deity in his hand. And Worm Apocalypse. Long time no see. So yeah, just activate an MST. And I was really lucky that I destroyed his Mirror Force. <laughs> Tachyon Chaos Hole. This card saved me a lot of times. It's a freaking awesome card. If you run if you run Galaxy over Photons, you must add this card. It's freaking awesome. So yeah, I just special summon my Galaxy Ice Photon, then go my Galaxy Knight, activate some random stuff, and I went for Sun Dragon because I'm I was afraid of a space down. Yeah, and at this point I was like really certain that I got the game. And because um, look I have like two three thousand attack monsters on the field and he has only two cards in his hand. And at this point my opponent gave <laughs> I am sorry, I'm sorry. And at this point my opponent gives up. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed this duel video. If you want the deck profile, um, just leave a comment in the comments below. And I'll make a video about this deck profile. And um, I am XRossM, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.